Hey guys, I'm Ouroboros. Let's play Persona 5 Royal. It is April 15th, and we are still looking for a way to get back at Kamoshida. I can't believe Suzuki senpai missed such an important meeting. I wonder what happened. Oh god. Mr. Kamoshida asked to see her. I've heard rumors about how the two of them like to... Two of them stay late together. I wonder what's going on. You don't think they're... Nah, it couldn't be. Man, it's been nothing but bad news lately. I'm worried about the future. Oh, that reminds me. Apparently a guest is coming to the school today. Some young guy, I think. Oh? Tell me more. Alright, looks like we got some dude coming today. That'll be cool. Maybe. Morning, please. There we go. So I assume all of you know about the separation of powers. There are three branches in our government. The National Diet is legislative, the Cabinet is executive, and the Supreme Court is judiciary. This division of power provides checks and balances, which ensures no one branch becomes unstoppable. Have you made up your mind? Whoa, dude. No matter how much thinking you do, there's only one option. You'd be better off just listening to me. Dude, how the hell did you get in there? Hmm, did I just hear a cat just now? Meow. That doesn't help. <laughs> Could that rumored cat be somewhere nearby? Settle down! We're in the middle of an important lecture. It's no use. I can't think of any other way. Dude, concentrate on class. I can't deal with that shit right now. I mean, what are we gonna do about Kamashita? Do we just go along with what that cat says? Urgh, that damn furball. If you only knew, I'm reading this too. Yeah, freaking furball. Wait. What's that? Enough! This is a classroom! Wait, she's going to jump! Suzui? Shiho? For real? Come Who on, let's go. It? Hey, stay in your seats! Do not step foot outside of this room! No way! Huh? Is she gonna commit suicide? It's Suzui! Shiho Suzui! Huh? Suzui, son! Hey, let's go look! What's going on? We should head to the courtyard too. I agree. This is not good. This is really, really, really not good. The, the hell is this? There's no way. No we get past all these goddamn people. Come on, let's try going through the practice building. All right, let's go through the practice building. Oh God, please tell me she's okay. Please, oh please, oh please, oh please tell me she's okay. Hey, let me through. What the hell? Let me through, man. Please. Oh, come on. Why does it take so long to get to the courtyard? Get out of my way. Please, oh please, oh please, oh please, oh please. Class is still in session. Shio. What the hell's wrong with these people? We need someone to go with her. Are there any teachers around? Uh, I'm not in charge of her class, though. We should leave this to Principal Kobayakawa. I'll go. Please hurry. Shio. Why? Mon, I'm sorry. I can't take this anymore. Shio. Huh? Kamoshida? No! Shio! Volleyball team. Return to your classrooms at once! That guy. Hey, wasn't Mishima acting weird? He gotta know something. 
We're gonna make him talk this time. Teachers, return to your classrooms for the time being. Please do not let any students go home yet. We gotta find Mishima. He knows something for sure. <sighs> that hurts. Why'd you run like that, huh? I didn't run. She jumped and tried to kill herself. <laughs> Leave me alone. Dude, you just, you gotta tell us. We're at that point. He's right. We ain't trying to get you busted. We won't say you talked either. Suzui. She was called out by Mr. Kamashita. Wait, what? I was called by him a number of times too. To the teacher's room. It wasn't just me or Suzui either. He'd nominate someone when he was in a bad mood and hit them. So the physical punishment thing was for real. And yesterday, he called Suzui out of the blue. She didn't make any mistakes or anything. Mr. Kamashita seemed really irritated that day. So it must have been worse than usual. He didn't. That son of a bitch! Uh. I bet Sakamoto's going to find Mr. Kamashita. Mr. Kamashita's probably in the PE faculty office on the second floor. All right, let's follow him. I got a feeling Ryuji's not going to be happy, and we both know Ryuji has a really, really bad temper. We can't make this worse. He went into the PE faculty office. Let's hurry. We have to go after him. I agree. We can't let this get out of hand, but, like, we got to do something. Huh? You bastard! The hell did you do to that girl? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me. That is enough. What you did was in coaching. What did you say? You, you ordered me to call Suzui here. I can only imagine what you did to her. You're going on and on about things you have no proof of. Basically. You're simply making these claims because you can't be a regular on the team, right? That's not what this is about. Even if it is exactly as you imagine it to be, hypothetically speaking, what can you do? We just received a call from the hospital. Suzui's in a coma, and her chances of recovery are slim. How would someone like that make a statement? There's no chance of her getting better, I hear. Oh, the poor girl. No. I can't be. You goddamn... This again? Does this mean we need to have yet another case of self-defense? You shut your mouth, you son of a bitch! Why are you stopping me? Dude, you can't let him get to you. But still... Oh, you're stopping him? What a surprise. There's no need to hold back. Why not attack me? Oh, you can. <laughs> but of course you can. Everyone present right now will be expelled. I'm reporting all of you at the next board meeting. What? You can't make a decision like that. Who would seriously consider what scum like you say? You threaten me too, Mishima. So you're just as responsible. Huh? To think you didn't know why I kept someone as talentless as you on the team. You act like you're a victim. But you leaked his criminal records, didn't you? It's all over the internet, correct? How terrible. Mishima? He told me to do it. I had no choice. <laughs> now, are we finished here? You're all expelled. You're done for. Your futures are mine to take. Now get out of my sight. I can't believe this asshole's getting away with this. He's not. We just can't give up. Huh? Oh, right. We have that. Huh? Have you lost your minds? 
You worthless kids aren't making any sense. But sure, go ahead and try. After all, you'll have plenty of time to kill until expulsion. Well, we found our answer. At least we know what we need to do now. Sucks that it came to this. We can't waste any time. We gotta hurry up and go to that world and beat the shit out of that asshole. We're not beating him up. We're simply stealing his distorted desires. But can we also can beat him up? You've made up your minds about this. About how he might suffer a mental shutdown? I have. Someone almost died because of him. I don't give a rat's ass what happens to him anymore. And you? Yeah, I agree. There's no other way. Let's do this. Then it's settled. By the way, is getting rid of a palace hard? You've tried it before, right? When did I ever say that? Huh? What? Were you just pretending to know? Is it true that you're getting expelled? Everyone's talking about it. That asshole's at it again. So you came all this way to tell us that? You're going to deal with Kamoshida? Let me in on it too. What? Why? You can't just sit back and do nothing after what happened to Shiho. This has nothing to do with you. Don't butt your head into this. But it does! Shiho's my... I said don't get in our way! <sighs> that was a little that harsh. harsh. Yeah, see? We can't take her somewhere like that. I hope she doesn't do anything too crazy. Women can be much bolder than men at times. We just gotta hurry up and deal with Kamoshida. Let's go already. Yeah, it's time. A girl almost killed herself. The moment we cross over, we'll treat each other like phantom thieves. So I hope you're ready. Uh huh? Phantom thieves? Those who covertly sneak in and stylishly steal treasure. That is what we become. I see. Not bad. I like it. Oh, that sounds kind of cool. So we just got to say the school, Kamoshida's name, and castle. Then we end up in Bizarro World. <laughs> Bizarro World? <laughs> Someone make it? I don't really know. Probably. I guess. I don't know. <laughs> That's kind of creepy, but uh, eh, seems useful enough. We'll show that effing Kamoshida. Let's go. They really are going to do something. They're doing something on their phone? The name... The school? Huh? Well, looks like she's getting dragged into this too. I guess it makes sense because, you know, she has a character portrait and a model. All right, time to bust on through. What is this? Sakamaki? That voice. Sakamoto? And are you? Why are you here? How should I know? What's going on? Hey, where are we? Isn't this the school? I see. Perhaps she was dragged in because of that app thing. If multiple people can enter with the person who uses it, it stands to reason it'll pull anyone nearby. For real? Wait, so this is related to Kamoshida? Anyways, you gotta leave. No! The shadows are going to find us if you make a scene. No way! It talked! Oh my god! Monster? You better explain what's going on. I won't leave until you do. <sighs> Looks like we gotta force her. But how are we supposed to do that? Just take her back to where we came in. That's how it worked last time, right? Oh, oh yeah. Can you lend me a hand? Yeah, I gotcha. I do feel bad, though. She kind of got dragged into this. What are you... We'll explain after everything's over. Just where are you touching? Whoa, sorry, I didn't mean... That's not important. You guys, seriously? Ah! <sighs> I 
Well, I hope she'll be okay. We better be careful from now on when we use that app. You should have checked the tools you used. Why do I, the one who was just watching, know more about it than you two? Shut up. Ah, jeez. It's a comic you found out right when we were starting off. We gotta deal with this fast. That girl's name is On Takamaki, right? Lady On. All right, dude. Let's let let's calm down. The shadows have noticed us. You better brace yourselves. Got it? We're counting on you, Joker. Joker? Is that a nickname? Don't refer to it in such a lame way. It's a code name. What kind of stupid phantom thief would use their real name? I'm not down for that. And there's no telling what kind of effect yelling our real names will have on the palace. It's just a precaution. So, uh, why is he Joker? Because he's our trump card when it comes to fighting strength. Not bad, I like it. It's settled then. Next up is you, Ryuji. You'll be... Let's see. Thug. Are you picking a fight with me? Yeah, I'll choose it myself! <laughs> When it comes to me, it's got to be this mask. Honestly, I actually kind of like it. What if we named me after this? Fine. Why not Skull, then? Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> I'm Skull! What do we do about this one's code name? Mm, I don't know. What do you think? How about Mona? Well, if Joker thinks it's easier to call me that, then I'll go with it. Yeah. All right. From here on out, we are Joker, Skull, and Mona. We need to be absolutely thorough about using those code names from now on. All righty. So we got our code names. Like a real organization. All right. Time to go steal this treasure thing. Let's make a dash for it. Tutorial. If you hold ZR while moving, you will be able to dash. This will help you traverse a palace quickly. But be careful. While dashing, you will be more easily spotted by enemies. So it's just as it sounds, we move faster, but also we make more noise and enemies are easier. Enemies have an easier time to spot us, so it's harder to ambush. Looks like they don't know about this way in yet. Joker, Skull, you ready? Let's go. Let us go indeed. Stealing treasures like real phantom thieves. So let's head on in, take a right. Uh, maybe not. Hey, look, ain't that... Those intruders the other day were quite entertaining. However... I can't allow that trash to ransack my castle. Strengthen the security, kill them on sight. I'll reward whoever brings me their heads. Praise be to King Kamashida. Death to the intruders. Hey, Mona, can't we just beat the crap out of him and call it a day? Look at all those soldiers, idiot. It'd be suicide. And I'm sure you don't want a repeat of last time. Besides, don't you want him to confess his sins? There's no point beating him up. We need to steal his materialized desires. The treasure. Fine. Uh, so where is it? It has to be somewhere in the depths of this castle. Let's infiltrate further in while he's out here. All right. So definitely don't want to go that way. I guess our only option is through this door. Ugh, another soldier. All right. What do we got here? What do we got? Damn it. There's a guard over here, too. What do you want to do? Should we kick its ass? Hold on. Hmm. This might be a good opportunity to teach you something. All right, Joker. You ready to take it down? Let's go. And whack it. All right, we got that another Remember how fairy thingy. Remember holdups and all out attacks? I'll teach you their practical use now. There's another use for holdups, besides simply defeating enemies. Shadows are beings born from people's hearts, so naturally they can talk too. In other words, you can communicate with them. Get it? If you talk to them when they're cornered, they might offer money or items since they don't want to die. In fact, talking has a better chance of scoring something great, as opposed to just offing them. Well then, let's do the first step. Knock all the enemies down and do a hold up. Alrighty, looks like we got another option, so let's just bop. Hold up! Seriously? You guys are the intruders that King Kamashita was talking about? It can't get worse than this. What are you gonna do with me? Give me some money. Huh? So you'll let me live if I just give you money? Well, something along those lines. Now let it be money or items. Just cough it up. 
Sorry. But this happened so suddenly, I don't actually have anything on me. I, I, I usually do, though, you know? Well, wait, what? Hmm. This isn't how I was planning this to go. Uh, if that's the case, I guess it's time for you to go to hell. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Sorry, but we're in a hurry. No, wait up. Can't we work something out? Don't kill me, please. Won't you let me go? Fine. Aren't you the type who can't say no? I totally know how you feel. I'm the same way. Whoa. I feel different. Something's happening. What the? What's going on? Oh, yeah. I remember now. I don't belong just to King Kamoshida. I'm an existence that drifts about in the sea of humanity's souls. My real name is Pixie. I am Pixie. From now on, I'll live on inside your heart. With that, we get a new mask. Persona taken. What was that just now? What happened? I don't know, man. You tell me. You're the expert here. Seems like you know how everything works. We get a whole whopping 2 XP. That's going to be helpful. Not. For real? What? What the hell was that about? The enemy got sucked into Joker's mask. I, I have no idea. I wasn't expecting that either. Oh, looks like we got caught. Intruders, halt! <laughs> Crap, they noticed us. Well, looks like we gotta fight our way through. Another weird horse thing. I think we'll be okay, though. I sense a new possibility within me, stemming from the previous battle. Changing personas! Ren's potential allows him to hold multiple personas. As such, you can freely change which persona you have summoned. When you change personas, your stats, attribute affinities, and available skills all change to match the persona you select. While in the persona menu, press L or R to change personas. Outside battle, press X and then select persona to change. You may normally change personas whenever you'd like, but during battle you can only change personas once per turn. So basically what that means is you can't just chain chain a bunch of one mores together. You've got to pick a persona in that turn and stick with it. The only exception is if you have a persona already equipped, you can use it, initiate a one more, and then switch personas. But for now, we can't use our send because tutorial, so let's change to Pixie. And Pixie has access to Zeo and Dia. This gives Ren, I guess Joker. Hold on. Did you take in the shadow's appearance and powers as a persona? So, Joker has the ability to wield many different personas, which inherently, obviously, makes him the best character in the game because he has access to literally everything, as opposed to other characters not having access to those things. Hold up. Let's just all out attack. Let's finish this. Didn't quite pick up the kill. All out attacks do a lot of damage, but they don't necessarily pick up kills. That's okay. Ryuji has access to Zeo skills anyway, so this should kill. Yeah, there we go. Holy! Does that mean you can wield multiple personas? And we get the kill. So, hold on. Give me, <laughs> give me a sec. I'm getting ahead of myself. Hey, Mona, what was that about? What did Joker do? He sealed the enemy's appearance and powers into his mask and made it his new persona. Is such a feat even possible? Even I've never seen anyone pull that off. Is this good? Of course it is. Only one heart exists per person, so normally a person can only have one persona. Incredible. That ability will give us a huge advantage in battle. All right, try to do that even more if the opportunity arises. You better help out too, Skull. Hell yeah! We'll hold every last one of them up! During a holdup, you can negotiate with any enemy's shadow. A successful negotiation may even earn you a new persona. If your enemy is a persona that you already have, a mask will appear beside its name. If you ask for it, lend me your power, it will grant experience to your own persona, even if it's not currently equipped. Decide whether you whether to defeat your foes quickly with all-out attacks and earn experience, or negotiate with them to obtain a persona or other reward. <laughs> I like you even more now. I really do have something special after all. So, 
like I was saying, Joker is the only character to wield multiple personas, which makes him the best character in the game. This negotiation system, this is kind of ish new for Persona 5. Uh, looks like there are bars in the way. I don't know why, but something feels off about this hallway. There's nothing we can do here right now. Let's try elsewhere. Uh, it's kind of new for Persona 5. It was in Shin Megami Tensei games, which is the series that Persona originates from. But in the past, for uh, getting new Personas, you would have what's called Shuffle Time, which you basically just draw for, from some cards. Uh, this has been completely overhauled for Persona 5, and honestly, I love it so much more. It's so much more creative and more entertaining than... Uh, just drawing cards. So, I have mentioned about making, um, or at least showing Persona bios. We are so, so, so close to being able to do that. I'm not going to do it quite yet. Uh, things will open up a little bit more later, in case you couldn't tell. We are a little railroaded right now. Uh, a lot of story restriction. So, I am going to just pick up Personas here and there and kind of deal with the bios in a little bit. Wait, it's not a good idea to be shooting so recklessly, ho. Lend me your power. He? Then let's talk, ho. If we're on the same wang wavelength, I'll think about it, ho. This again? This is be he coming a kind of hassle, ho. Humans always want either an autograph or a self-he-ho. <laughs> okay, so this... <laughs> this is jack-o'-lantern. Which is it, ho? Um... Uh, I want an autograph. He, huh? You didn't bring a pen or any paper. I'm not going to sign the back of a receipt, ho. He, hey. <laughs> okay, so this is Jack-O-Lantern. And you've, it used to be known as Pyro Jack. And Jack-O-Lantern or Pyro Jack has a different... Hold on, I'm reading. To tell you the truth, this is all an act, ho. What do you think I'm really like, ho? I think you're fine as is. Yeah, I know, ho. I'm worried I don't offer enough variety, ho. I remember, I feel like we're similar. He, ho, oh, he, god damn it. <laughs> okay, so we got, we got Jack-O-Lantern. So Jack-O-Lantern and his kind of opposite partner, uh, Jack Frost, which is the, I guess, mascot for Atlas. They have these like he, ho speech things and they're so funny and I can never read them or like speak in it without laughing because I just think it's so funny. Uh, but we got another one. Like I said, I will be doing Persona Bios later. What a score, Joker. Why not give it a try? So we can open chests and sometimes we'll get items. And if it's already an upgrade from something we have, like this is a better melee weapon, right. I think, uh, it will automatically... Oh, crap. Okay, here we go. Uh, so there you saw that we got spotted and the uh, security level changed. So what that means is... It'll be harder. Oh, jeez. Um, it will be harder to ambush enemies. Are we next? No, we're not. I should have just used Pixie. Um, it'll be harder to ambush enemies, and also, if they spot us, they'll start chasing after us. It's pretty basic. So, uh, we've got a new guy here. Whoa, let's not be rash. Look, I won't say anything to King Kamashita, all right? I didn't mean to press X. I meant to go to negotiation. <laughs> That's fine. There will be plenty more opportunities to get personas in the future. I'm not really worried about it now. It's also kind of hard to commentate and also read the dialogue that they have because you do have to answer correctly in negotiation to get them. Um, and there are a bunch of different options which the game should get into later. Um, but for now, I don't think it'll talk. Okay, so before we go into this room, if you have the DLC and have the bonus 100,000 yen, you can proceed as normal. If you either don't have the DLC or don't want to use the 100,000 yen for whatever reason, you will need to grind some money. Okay? So what happens is you need to go back to the entrance from here, save, kill those three enemies, and just grind up money. Okay? But since I have 104,000 yen and I only need 15... Um, plus, we do need some items. We need two tin clasps. Um, I don't see any. And we need two silk yarn, which we can buy. So if you don't have the two tin clasps and don't have the two silk yarn, instead of uh, 15,000 yen, you'll need 19,100 yen. But again, the yen is the only thing from the DLC that I plan on using 
just because it's gonna save so much of my own time for grinding. Okay, so if you've got all that, if you wanna go back and grind a little bit more for whatever reason, you can do that. However, if you feel comfortable, you can walk hey, forward and go into this door. Oh, it's another hazy looking door. What's that thing called? Uh, what's it called? A uh, safe room? We can discuss our strategy inside. There are a lot of places even I don't know about in here. Sounds like a plan. This is that place from earlier. What's up with this app? Just said the word Sakamoto said and I ended up... Princess? Huh? Princess! Aren't there even more shadows here than before? Just getting this far has been a real pain in my ass. It's all because you guys provoked Kamoshida, you know. Still, he seems to be awfully on guard. Anyways, how are we supposed to steal that treasure thing? Don't be so hasty. First, we'll need to secure an infiltration route. A uh, what? A path to the treasure's location. But honestly, I think we'll need a little more manpower in order to accomplish this. At the very least, one more person would be nice. Hey, you say you don't have your memories and all, but somehow you still know about that kind of stuff? Do you think this thing's really got amnesia? I don't know, but I mean, he seems like he's been pretty honest, so I believe in him. At least you're a step above that moron. Don't call me a moron! You sure talk big, but what if it turns out you're just some stray cat in the end? That can't be. Still, why was a princess in such an odd place? Princess? I could have sworn we were pursuing the readings of an intruder. It doesn't matter now. We must take her back to King Kamashita. Who's this princess they're talking about? I should probably look into this. And yet another question goes unanswered. Stuff like the castle and that navigation app are mysterious, <laughs> but Morgana's got them both beat. Uh, you mean Mona, right? Oh, crap, sorry. What was I again? Oh, yeah, uh, Skull. <laughs> this is bad. That was fast. Your friend, Lady On. She's been taken by shadows! Wait, what? We sent her home earlier. If Lady On does indeed have the app, it could be possible. Oh no. Don't tell me it got put on hers just like mine. Damn it. We let her out for her own safety and she just came back in by herself. Well, looks like we gotta go save her. Damn it. Damn it, we don't got time to be taking a break. We need to hurry and rescue her. I agree. Follow me, I'll guide you. Okay, let's go. She's just past that dining room looking place. Let's go. I agree. Is this some kind of filming? Who is in charge here? There's a shadow right there. I'm gonna try to avoid them right now because we got bigger fish to fry than some guard. Yeah, this is bad. She doesn't know what's going on. You ready? Yeah, I'm good to go. Let's go. What's all this about? Seriously, I'm gonna call the cops. So this is the intruder. Kamoshida? Who's that? More importantly, what is this place? Why is the school turned into something like this? I can't believe you mistook my aunt for someone like her. <laughs> Are you afraid? What is that outfit? Have you lost your mind? I do as I please here. After all, this is my castle. The world of my desires. What the... Wait... Is this some red light district? What a lively slave. This isn't funny! Enough of the bullshit! 
Kamoshida. <laughs> the girls decided to tell me off. What do you think of that? Talking back is like totally unforgivable. In that case, she should be executed. <laughs> now then, how should I play with you? Shall I tear you into little pieces? Are you kidding me? This is effed up. Is that what he thinks of the girls on the volleyball team? Hey, that's... Takamaki! Just when I was about to start enjoying myself. What's the deal with this guy? You little... How many times are you gonna come back? I bet you just like those thieves. You came because you're pissed at me, huh? But, uh... Ah, I forget that chick's name. But it's your fault she jumped, you know. Huh? You were so reluctant to throw yourself onto me that I had her take your place. You bastard! <laughs> no! Take one more step and I'll kill her on the spot. Damn it! Just sit back and enjoy the dismantlement show. No, don't! Maybe I'll start with the clothes. <laughs> You're such a perv! Hey, what are we gonna do? Takamaki! Is this... my punishment for what happened to Shio? That's more like it. You should have looked like this from the start. Shio... I'm so sorry. You're just gonna listen to him? Huh? No. I don't want that. You're right. Letting this piece of shit toy with me. <laughs> what was I thinking? It's like I always say. Slaves should just behave and... Shut up. I've had enough of this. You piss me off, you son of a bitch! My, it's taken far too long. Uh, uh, Tell me, who is going to avenge her if you don't? Forgiving him was never the option. Such is the scream of the other you that dwells within. I am thou, thou art I. We can finally forge hear you, Carmen. You're right. No more holding back. <gasps> there you go. Nothing can be solved by restraining yourself. Understand? Then I'll gladly lend you my strength. Cheap girl you can toy with, you scumbag. Bitch! You stole everything from Shiho. You destroyed her. Now it's your turn! I will rob you of everything! How dare you! Enough of your insolence! No, I've had enough of you! No one's gonna stop me now! Let's go, Carl! Alrighty, we got On and Carmen. Let's go, baby. Another awakening. How dare you deny King Kaboshida's love, you selfish lass? Pay for this insolence with your life. That dirtbag just sees women as sexual outlets. Don't make me laugh with that love bullshit. Come on, Carmen. Let's give him hell. Alrighty, so Carmen has... Agi and fire skills, I guess they're the same thing, and Dia. 
As you can see, one of my friends is playing online. I'm realizing now that I should probably turn those notifications off so that they don't interrupt me when I'm recording the things you learn when you're doing your first Let's Play. It's fine, though. Uh, I do realize that I don't have Ryuji healed up, which is kind of unfortunate. However, we've got Jack Lantern, which also has Agi skills. So, just kidding, we can't do another all attack. Um, I was going to say that we could do another all attack and heal up Ryuji, so we can only do one of those. Ryuji only has you. Are you. Do you resist gun? No, you don't. Garu. Oh. That's not good. Uh, that's really bad. Do I want to keep on... Uh, this got really out of hand really quickly. Um, do I want to stay on Jack Lantern if it has Augie skills? I feel like I don't. Or if it has Garu skills, I think I'm just going to switch... Arsene, go for physical attacks? Just kidding, it resisted. Love to see it. Yeah, that, that went bad real quick. But anyway, we're back up, we're good. What about Zeo? You're resisting Zeo, which is not good. Okay, that's alright, that's alright. So, do I try to end it now? So if I switch to Jack Lantern, this Joker's all out of attack kill here. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're super good. We're chilling. Go to Jack Lantern. Yep. Got the cut in. Not missing this time. Hold up. Let's finish this. Uh, I should have ended it with On's portrait, but that's all right. I'm sure we'll get plenty of chances to show it later. Every character has a unique all-out attack portrait, which we'll see throughout the course of the playthrough, but it just would have been nice to line that up with On's Awakening. But Zoro gets a new skill. Patra. Cures Dizzy, Forget, Sleep, Hunger for one ally. That will be useful if we ever have any of those statuses. Oh, shit. Wait! Why'd you come here, man? And more importantly, how? Hey, is that how you speak to a woman? Are you all right, Lady On? Lady On? Wait, what is this thing? Is it alive? How can it talk? And where in the world are we? J just calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Don't worry. How am I supposed to calm down? Huh? Why am I dressed like this? When did I... <sighs> What's with this? Calm down. You look great. Well, I'm stumped. A search party will be coming for us soon. There's no time to explain. We don't have a choice. Let's retreat for now. We were just getting fired up and you had to go and get in the way. <sighs> Fine. Here, give me your arm. You take the other side. Well, looks like we got another friend who can use a persona. And right when Morgana said we could use another person, so... Could be helpful. Thanks. Looks like we made it back. Hey, are you okay? Well, pretty much. Wait, I lied. I'm still confused about all of this. You may be safe now, but a lot sure did happen back there. At any rate, we stand out too much here. Let's relocate to a safer spot. I agree. We need some time to explain all this stuff. It's confusing. Which one you want? Whichever's not carbonated. Uh, they're both actually. Then... Here you go. Ah, oh, thanks, man. You don't want anything? What about me? Huh? But uh, you're a cat. <laughs> Have you calmed down, Lady On? Um... Morgana, right? I really am talking to a cat. This feels so strange. Oh, sorry. You're not a cat, right? It's only natural that you're confused. 
Demanding that you understand all of this right after what you went through is asking too much. Honestly, I still can't believe what happened. And that power... And my persona... It's the will of your rebellion, Lady On. With it, you'll be able to fight in that other world. So if what you told me is true, we can make Kamoshida have a change of heart, right? Is it really possible? Can we actually force him to confess his crimes? The volleyball team's keeping quiet about this while teachers and parents turn a blind eye. If guys like us try and complain, they're just gonna shoot us down. Going all in on this plan is the only choice we got. Then let me help too. I want to make him pay for what happened to Shiho. He just keeps going like nothing happened, even after what he did to her. I'll never forgive him. Wait, did you just say, let me help? You mean you want us to take you along? Don't act like I'm going to drag you down. Weren't you watching? I can fight too. Hey, what should we do? I mean, she did pretty well. I got a feeling she'll be great. I agree as well. We are lacking in manpower after all. Don't worry. I'll protect her. Uh, of course Even you will. Even if you said no, I'd just go in alone. Ah, right. She can go by herself. I guess it'd be more dangerous turning her down. Ah, fine. Then it's decided. Well, <laughs> I hope we get along. I'm going to make Kamoshida atone for what he did. Not just for Shiho's sake, but for everything he's done. I won't let any more people suffer because of him. I'll do whatever it takes. That's fair. I sense a strong fighting resolve from On. A group like yours must have relied on subtlety and misdirection. Otherwise, you'd never survive. Some of you might even have been hiding behind a public face their entire lives. If you're listening, then answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the lover's persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. And with that, we have unlocked Lover's Rank 1 on Takamaki. All right. Fusing personas of the Lover's Arcana will now grant you EXP due to the Arcana Burst. Awesome. Just let me know when you're heading back in. Oh, wait. We don't have each other's info. Hey, give me your number and chat ID. And, um... Damn, boys, we got a girl's number. Let's go! And low battery! You love to see it. On you then. Same goes for you, Morgana. The pleasure is all mine, Lady On. What a kind girl. Such admirable consideration for others. And the innocence to cast herself into the jaws of death to achieve her goal. She cares about her friends, and she's beautiful to boot. What a girl. She's captured my heart. Dude. Bruh. You know, it'd be better if this group could get together quick from now on. True. Our best option would be to make a secret hideout where we could discuss these things. A hideout, huh? I like the sound of that. The school rooftop would work. It seems like nobody goes up there. For the time being, that will make the perfect hideout. I can't contact you from inside a palace, so I'll stay in this world. That being said, I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm personally nominating you. You should feel honored. Wow, I'm so honored. This is all you. There's no way I can at my place. Well, looks like we got a cat. So let's meet there tomorrow. Sounds good, Ryuji. Okay, let's go look at my new residence for this world. Uh, I don't know if you're gonna feel good about that. The Shujin Academy rooftop will be your hideout from now on. Alrighty. Looks like we got a team. 
This is looking good for us, hopefully. Stay upstairs while we're open for business. Jeez, dude, chill. Punk rock woman. I kind of want to talk to her. Yes. Hey, lay off the customers. Sorry if he was rude, doctor. I don't mind. Come on, you're getting in the way. Go on upstairs. Mm, no, I'm gonna talk to her again. Try not to bother the customers. Come on, you're getting in the way. Go on upstairs. All right. Well, never mind. Fine. Screw you. Thanks. I'll see you later. Come back again. <laughs> That's it for today. Who was that? Oh, that customer just now. She's the head doctor over at that clinic down the street. Rumor has it she gives pretty crappy examinations and sells some weird homemade medicines on top of that. At least, that's what I've heard. I haven't been there myself. They should really just leave her alone. It's not like she's getting in the way of their lives. Hey, are we there yet? <sighs> well, I gotta get home and start making dinner. Well, sounds like we're kind of similar to that doctor. I got a feeling Morgana's not going to like this room. What the? What is this place? Told you. Is this some kind of abandoned house? Hey, are you? I was wondering why I heard meowing. What did you bring it here for? Dude, it was abandoned. You can't just leave a cat out there. Come on. That's... It's a shame. Look, this place is a restaurant. Animals are a no-go. Though, I guess you might stay on good behavior if you've got a pet to take care of. Fine, but keep it quiet when we're open for business. And don't let it roam downstairs, or I'll toss it out. Oh, and I'm not going to take care of it. That's all on you. I should be able to do that. I've got a cat in real life anyway. I'm fine. Is that the ruler of this place? Something like that. He seemed pretty understanding for someone who keeps you cramped up in this dump. Then again, I suppose to normal people, I just sound like a meowing cat. Seriously. I had to keep calling out in that cute little voice. Make sure you wash that dish. By the way, uh, have you decided on a name? Yeah, Morgana. Morgana? Huh. I was hoping I'd get to name it. Well, looks like he likes it. So much that he wanted looks to name like it. Chief likes me better than you. Eh, it's not that hard. Everybody hates me. Except for Ryuji and On and, honest, and you. This place is heaven compared to Kamoshida's cells. Remember how you guys asked me before about what I am? To be honest, I don't remember anything about my birth. I think the metaverse's distortions made me lose both my memories and my true form. Is that form human? I hope so. It has to be. I mean, why else would a cat be able to talk like this? There's no other possible explanation. There's no doubt that the distortions were what caused me to lose my real self. I'm sure that once they're purged, I'll finally be able to get that self back. And I have a pretty good idea on how to do it, too. That's why I was in the castle in the first place. Come to think of it, I didn't get hungry over in that world. Hmm. Do we get hungry in that other world? Let me make myself clear. Your taking care of me won't be for nothing. It'll be give and take. Due to my knowledgeable and dexterous nature, I have a lot of intel on infiltration tools. Hmm, really? What exactly are those? Well, I can't tell you more unless we settle on a deal. In exchange for you keeping me here, I'll teach you about these tools. How does that sound? Yeah, I like the sound of that. Let's do this. I like that answer. <laughs> then it's a deal. Morgana seems rather happy. Looks like we've made yet another deal and are slowly growing our confidant list. Skillful infiltrations and escapes to all manner of places. There's even the possibility that you use special tools and had someone who manufactured them. Answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It 
shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the magician persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. And we've unlocked the, the magician arcana, Morgana. So we get a new ability, Infiltration Tools, which allows us to right. craft basic infiltration tools. We also get XP from Arcana Burst when fusing Personas of the Magician Arcana. I'll lecture you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right, I'm going to stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strengths born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills too. This is all part of our deal. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Seems like a decent deal though. I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? Wouldn't dream of it. Also, I'll accompany you when you go out. Don't worry, it's free of charge. Getting around in cat form sounds pretty inconvenient, though. Well, it is what it is. I'll just have to deal with being carried around in that bag of yours. On, oh, thanks for everything today. You saved me and I didn't even thank you properly. Don't worry about it. I can't. Anyway, I wanted to let you know at least. See you tomorrow. You guys send messages to each other with that thing, right? Yeah. I want in too. So, I'm going to have to ask you to type for me. <laughs> okay, buddy. At any rate, is it really a place for some Is this really a place for someone to live? Hey man, this is the she best we got. Me. You know, when everybody hates your guts and you're a criminal and and all that stuff, you got to take what you can get. But for now, let's just go to sleep. It's been a long day. Well then. Tomorrow's going to be another busy day. Keep it together, all right? Let's go to sleep. I feel a strange weight pressing down on my body. Is this the stress of Kamashita's threat weighing on me? Something like that. 